We're at the mountain of Herodium, and you can see behind me. Uh, basically, it started out as another one of his uh, palace fortresses, but then he, as he knew his end was near, he wanted this place turned into his mausoleum, his shrine, <clears throat> where he was buried. Well, that's interesting, and we've talked about this when we went through uh, the, the beginning, the nativity story. In the background is the area of Bethlehem, and so you've got Herod's palace right overlooking uh, the area of Bethlehem and we've talked about this a lot on, on these devotions but the the concept of who the world would choose versus who the, you know the spirit would choose and so when the wise man came and say where is he that is born king of the Jews um, you know Herod was had the title king of the Jews but he wasn't the real king so we need to remember to uh, not seek the world you know the places like Herodium um, catch our attention but you know it's the humble baby in the lowly manger that that, that that who should have our attention